Hey, welcome back to the channel. And if you're new here, thanks for stopping in. I'm going to do a very quick uh, tutorial on how to paint one of our layered uh, digital designs that we have out on Etsy. Uh, this is one of our keychains, but you can also apply this to any other STL file that you need to paint. So first of all, I've already brought in the keychain into Bamboo Studio. I recommend doing this on your laptop in Bamboo Studio instead of trying to do it on the app. So once you do that, I'm going to go up here and just make sure I have my device chosen. Um, we have a couple printers, so I'm going to do that. And then go back over to prepare and I just want to make sure that I sync my AMS. I'm going to sync that. It's loaded all my colors. I don't need that fifth one. Now I'm going to select the keychain on the plate there. I'm going to go up to the paint bucket, open that up, and then you'll see my filament colors are here. And let's just say for the fun of it, we are going to paint that top layer, layer black, just because I have that highlighted right now. I recommend on projects like this to do the height range type paintbrush. So this is going to paint in layers. Um, this keychain is about two millimeters high on the top layer, and that's the one that we're going to paint black. So you can set that range. You can either use the triangle to move it up and down, or you can type a range right in. Let's zoom in a little bit here. And you're going to see, hopefully on the screen, that there is this line. That is where you're going to paint. So try to bring it as close to the bottom there. And as soon as you're happy with it, click and it paints above it. Now, if this top layer was a little taller, taller, excuse me, you could move your cursor up and paint a little bit more. So you don't have to be exact with this measurement here. It will let you keep painting in the brush strokes. Then I just click this to close and zoom back out and you're ready to go ahead and then uh, do your preview and your slice and send it off to the printer. Hope this helps. Have a great one.